Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to my channel, Plus Size in Canada. My name is Miranda, and I am so excited that you are here today. I am about to go into Giant Tiger. It's eight o'clock in the morning. They just opened. I have seen so many of my friends find some really cool Christmas things um, at Giant Tiger, and I haven't been there in a couple months. So I'm excited. I'm going to get a few groceries because they always have really good deals at Giant Tiger. So I am going to get a few groceries, but I'm also going to look at the Christmas stuff. Take a scan around the entire store. I am so excited for this. I have been waiting for this for like, like actually waiting for payday <laughs> for like a couple weeks because Miranda's been spending a lot of money on some things. But um, yeah, Giant Tiger has really good deals. So I am so ready and I am excited to take you along with me. And if you're from the States and you don't know, or I mean, I have friends from the UK too, from Italy, so many places. It's amazing. Um, Giant Tiger is basically Canada's Walmart. We do have Walmart here too in Canada and Walmart probably still makes more money than Giant Tiger does, but Giant Tiger is like the, the competition. It's the Canadian department store. So anyways, I'm excited. Come with me. Let's see what I find. Oh, okay. Let's go. They have some really cute t-shirts here for $7, but these are the straight sizes and their extra large is a true extra large. It's not a big one. So I'm going to have to check the plus size section. You guys, they have some in the plus size section. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh, whoops. I dropped one. I'm definitely going to have to pick up at least one. Oh, fun. You guys, they have a whole bunch of licensed tees here and also licensed underwear. Oh, <laughs> so exciting. There's some in my cart. I have to get this for Curtis. <laughs> Isn't that so cute? Giant Tiger really does have good deals on food all the time. Boys would love to try these for two seventy seven. I think we'll try some of these too. And these are on sale for six ninety seven. So I'm gonna grab one of these too. Of course, the kids love egos, and I actually don't even like eggnog, but that is exciting to see. That means Christmas is here. They have so many amazing little girl themed prints and they actually are really well priced. Six dollars. Have a flamazing Christmas. So cute. Oh my goodness. Seriously, you guys. Winnie's going to love this. These are really cool. Five dollars each. Gift mugs. Very cool. These would be cool for Sheppy to bring the kids. Sheppy's our elf on the shelf, if you don't know. He's a shepherd on the search. So we could grow a tree. Let's grow a reindeer. And let's grow a Santa. Cute. Two dollars. Love it. Look at these Santas. <laughs> How cute are they? I've been wanting to get a camper to represent our camping. <laughs> and Luke's got a little Christmas tree and they're only, actually, I don't know. There's no price tag. I'll tell you later. <laughs> Anybody's husband need some beard bulbs? <laughs> That's festive. You guys, I did so well. I cannot wait to get home and show you everything I got. Okay, you guys, I didn't forget. <laughs> I stopped off at Walmart just now. 
I'm gonna run in. I'm keeping my fingers crossed <clears throat> that I can find that catacorn ornament that Winnie thought that I already bought for her. If you watched our first, uh, we had two parts of our Christmas decorating, but the first part, um, the kids went and picked out their new Christmas ornaments because we buy them a new one every year. And it was a little chaotic at the time. If you watched the video, then you know. But um, I was trying to tell Winnie that I picked up that catacorn ornament thinking she would want it, but I wanted to wait and let her come pick which one she wanted by herself. And she... I didn't finish my sentence and she took what I said and thought that that meant that I bought it for her. So I don't want to tell her I didn't buy it because she picked the unicorn one. She literally says in the video, oh, because you picked up the cat one for me, I'm going to pick the unicorn. So <laughs> mom fail. I am hoping that they still have one of those freaking kitties. So come with me. Let's go find it. That was a close call. Out of all of these ornaments, and over there too, there's two left. <laughs> now there's one left. <sighs> okay. The mom fail is recovered. <laughs> all right, you guys, I'm back home. And what I'm going to do is show you the grocery items first, and then I'm saving the best for last. So I'll show you the fun Christmas stuff that I got. Um, what I spent all together was $245. So honestly, I feel like I did really well, especially because I got some Christmas Eve presents checked off the list. So I'm excited to show you what I got for food. I feel like especially the food, man, I got some really, really good deals. So let me flip the camera around and I will show you. All right, here are all the groceries. And I find Giant Tiger has things that I normally wouldn't buy too. Just because they're on a good deal, I end up picking them up, but it's kind of fun for change. Um, I grabbed two packs of this lean ground beef. They were each $10. I grabbed one block of the Great Value cheese. This is very comparable to the Great Value if this isn't even the same cheese. It might be, honestly, they might be made in the same factory. I do not know. Um, these Wonder Wraps were on sale for $1.88 each, so I grabbed two of those. And we haven't had corn in a while, so I figured the boys would like to have that because they really like corn with their meals. So this was $2.27. This was on sale for $2.97, I believe, or $2.77, sorry. But we've never had it before. It looks fun. It looks like something we've had at Swish LA, the restaurant, before. Um, of course, I bought the box, the chicken strips. I actually checked to see what the grams were um, because sometimes they have the same price for less grams, but this was 700 and it was the same as the other three. I think they were $6.97 each. Um, Jasper's smelling everything right now. It's funny. I grabbed some of these. We've never tried this English style filet before, but I'm kind of pumped to try it. I love fish sticks and those were $5.99, I think. <laughs> um, these were definitely $5.99. Curtis, I bought you wings. <laughs> uh, barbecue. He loves wings and we haven't had them in forever. So we're going to give those a try. So these are like a fun Christmassy thing. Um, definitely a luxury item, I would say. Not something I would typically buy, but because of the beautiful Christmas theme, I have to. I've bought them every year for the last few years and I never regret it. Um, these were on for $1.97, but you can buy them I mean, Walmart has them, Superstore has them, Sobe ha Sobeys has them. So you can buy them anywhere, but I love that. I think they're so cute, and it's like putting a little Christmas decoration on your counter, which I love. Um, these were on for $2, so I grabbed that for the boys. These were $1.77. I grabbed that, and oh, I didn't even remember that I bought these, but I'm glad I did because Winnie absolutely loved these, even though they stink so bad and they make her breath stink so bad i love pizza but that's nasty i don't know why the kids all the kids love them i don't know why um their craft dinner was on for a dollar 77 actually this might have been a dollar 25 and these ones were a dollar 77 um there were only two original left so i grabbed both of them and then whoa the tower white cheddar is a favorite amongst the entire family as well. Oh my goodness, the tower. Um, so I grabbed three of those. These were on sale as well. 
So those were $2. Um, Cooper told me the other day his very favorite kind of chips are Pringles, which I didn't know that and I never would have guessed that. So um, I bought those for him basically, but for everybody. And they were on for $1.88. Um, this was just under $2 at $1.97. And I always like to buy um, pizza sauce in a squirt bottle, squeeze bottle, because we eat a lot of pita pizzas here. And not all of us like um, pizza sauce. So like Curtis, oh, okay, just lay down then, just lay down. Curtis likes the Diana sauce. He likes like a barbecue pizza. So it's nice to have different squirt bottles so that everybody can have the flavor that they want. This was a steal, $1.77. Um, and it's not due until November 13th. And it looks actually really good. So I'm impressed with that. Um, I got two cans of my favorite tuna. I make tuna salad with these. Um, and they were on for $147, which is also a great deal. Um, I got some of Winnie's. She calls them all dressed up. This is a Canadian flavor. I believe only Canadian flavor. Let me know if you guys have tried these. These actually are really good. Um, these were on for $2.97. Also, I got everyone's favorite party mix. Yummy for $2.97 and the veggie straws as well. Um, these were also $2.97 and I got the blueberry waffles, which is Winnie's favorite. And Skylar really likes these pancakes. He also really likes the um, chocolate chip ones, but they didn't have those. So I got both of these and Cooper likes both. So he's good to go. Um, I grabbed a Wonder Bread for $1.88. Um, and the only things left are these. These were on sale for $2.97. This is the Mrs. Dunster's brand, which is made like 30 minutes away from my house in Sussex, which is really cool. Um, so always like to support them and they are really good. And the kids use them as sub buns, but I also use them as make your own garlic bread, which is really yummy and really fun. It cooks up really good in the oven. These were on for $1.88 and I opened the package right up to feel I like to do that. It might be a little invasive for some, but if you ever brought cherry tomatoes home and have them be totally soft and disgusting, these are not soft. They're perfect. So grab those. And this was a great deal too. $1.97 for four peppers. Are you freaking kidding me? That's a great deal. All right. So now I'm excited. I'm going to like do my little bibbity bobbity boo and then there will be Christmas stuff. Bibbity bobbity boo. And there's the Christmas, you guys. A little bit of Christmas magic. Um, I'm going to show you everything that I got. So you guys saw these um, in one of the clips. I grabbed three of these. They were $2 each. And they're the kind of things that you put in water. It says it's going to grow to 600% in water. That's kind of a lie. I feel like they never actually get that big. Um, but, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I just dirty minded you guys. Okay. I can't help it. I'm sorry. Um, anyways, <laughs> I got these for Sheppy to give the kids one morning. Um, this was only $2.99. So I feel like, I mean, it's not superly duperly done. Like it is a little bit cheap looking, but I just want a little representation of what our summers are all about on our Christmas tree. So that will look lovely on it. Um, I did buy myself three shirts. <laughs> Sorry. Um, you guys know I have so many Christmas leggings, but I need some tops to go with the leggings. So I'll do a little try on haul with okay. those. <laughs> Here's Curtis. <laughs> okay. I bought a shirt for Curtis. Perfect timing. Okay. <laughs> I just walked up with helium in my mouth. Oh, you did? I like swallowed it and it left. <laughs> <laughs> I heard it, but I didn't know that was helium. Okay. Yeah. Um, I'm going to give you the shirt. Here you go. This is for you. It's for Christmas and it's only for fun. Ooh. Very Do nice. Do you see what it is? Yep. It says, oh, what fun it is to ride. I like it. <laughs> I like it a lot. Yeah, I think it's cool. I really do. That's Cute. Cool. Very cool. You're I, welcome. You should be wearing a helmet, though, really. I'm, He's Santa. I'm not like one of those He's American magic. riders that don't hey. wear helmets. Hey. And this shirt was only $10 and it will go really good with all of his jeans because he's not cool like me. He doesn't have Christmas leggings. <laughs> um, I grabbed this, you guys. Hello for the queen. Rapunzel is Winnie's very favorite princess. I could not leave this here at the store. I had to grab it. Um, $7.97. What a deal. And to go with that, this is going to be a Christmas present or maybe in her stocking, I thought. Um, 
Anyways, I thought this would couple really nicely with this. Look at the pack of socks. There's, you can tell there's a Ariel sock, there's the Jasmine, um, of course, my queen, Belle, um, Aurora, and Cinderella. So, and those were $7.97 as well. And honestly, I think Winnie would love to see these in her stocking, but I need to go through everything and see. <laughs> there's a lot of stuff for Winnie already, so we'll see where it will fit in. And the reason why my boys cannot watch this video, actually Cooper never watches my videos, but he is really proud of me and he's adorable. But um, I'm gonna have to tell them they can't watch it because every Christmas we buy them Christmas um, jammies to wear on Christmas Eve. So they get to open that present on Christmas Eve. And I thought Value Village, no, what store was I at? Not Value Village, um, Giant Tiger came through you guys i was so impressed i was so so impressed to have these real licensed tees they both are from the correct licensing they're not fake they're real they're legit and um they were 11.97 are you kidding me son of a nutcracker love it and griswold family christmas honestly i don't know which one we're going to give to each boy because it's just too exciting. But you know, you guys, are you kidding me with this? They're going to get the matching underwear. Yes, Jasper is playing with the ball. Um, they are going to get the matching underwear for $11.97 to go with it. Isn't this so cute? Oh, this makes me so excited. What a steal. What a good find. And to get it exactly in the right sizes. You know you're being a little noisy. Do you know what mommy's trying to do right now? Huh? Do you want mommy to throw it? Go get it. Ooh, I almost hit the light. All right. So that is all the stuff that I got. Let me try on my new shirts for you. Okay. You guys see, I'm excited for the stuff I got other people. <laughs> but I'm... A little more excited about what I got for myself. Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> so I am wearing Mr. Grinch, of course, um, which this is like one of my very favorite shirts. I got it last year. And look what I picked up for myself. I'm kind of a big deal. Yes, you are for $11.97. So excited. What did I get? This was in the men's section um, and I got it in an extra large. They did have um, double extra large, which I thought, nah, should I get that one? But it was like really long. And I thought that's gonna be basically a nighty. Um, so Curtis is here right now. So he's not gonna get mad when he watches the video. I am wearing a tank top, fully covered. <laughs> Cause he really doesn't like it when I get changed on camera. There are a few choice people that leave comments sometimes that we have to delete, but that's okay. Um, look, ah, it's so cute. I love it and the extra large is perfect <gasps> look how and it's like so dr susy with the um design oh my goodness new favorite t-shirt guys oh i love it i love it yes oh i was i actually had one of these picked up for the boys um in a size small but then i saw the underwear and i was like they didn't have any grinch underwear i totally would have bought cringe underwear if they had them, but they didn't. So um, then I had the idea I should do um, the underwear to match the shirts. And then I was like, but somebody's got to get this shirt. And then I was like, it can be me. <laughs> um, okay. So the next two or the only other two shirts that I got were both from the plus size section. The women's extra large in these licensed tees or like these, they're not licensed, whatever they are. They're the, um, let's see what kind they are. It's the Giant Tiger brand. So anyways, the extra large, they were not very big at all. Um, I could have got a 1X and I maybe should have, but I got two Xs. So hopefully they work. Um, $9 for each of these Giant Tiger brand. And they're just so cute and fun. Look at the gingerbread man. Oh, stop. You're killing me. I love it. Um, but you know, sometimes these shirts shrink a bit and I thought, if I got a 1X and I put it in the washer and in the dryer, it's likely gonna shrink. 
And I, oh, okay, I'm very glad I got the 2X. Very glad. This, whoo, <laughs> I love it, it's perfect. I was worried because it did look a little bit big right here, but I think it's absolutely perfect. Oh, guys, don't I look so cute? Oh, I love it, I love it. I like, I'm telling you guys, years ago, like five, six years ago, we didn't have clothes like this. Plus size girls missed out on all the fun clothes because they thought maybe only straight size women like to be festive. So that's a piss off and plus size need it too, guys. Come on. I'm so happy the dynamics of the clothing market have changed to include everyone because everyone should be included all the time in all things. It is not fun feeling left out. Okay, so this is the other one. Oh, guys, it's Rudolph. I didn't even notice. He's got a red nose. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. And you know what? These could work as jammy tops, too, if you're going to, like, a pajama party or something. Oh, you guys. This is so... My hair is a wreck in this video. I'm sorry. I'm excited. What can I say? Oh, and the snowflakes. Yes, for $9, guys, nine bucks. And I'm glad that I got it early. Like it is, what is the date? I don't know, November or something. It's Thursday. This video is going up tomorrow, so <laughs> that's what it is. Um, anyways, uh, I'm happy that I got it early because now I can wear it for two whole months. Yes, I can. <laughs> so fun. And if you get in there early, then you can have the pick of the litter as well, right? So this is exciting. I do want to send some love to my subscribers in the UK. You guys are in my thoughts and prayers, honestly. I was talking about you guys in that giant tiger um, to the cashier actually, because it's so sad that you guys are in a lockdown right now. <clears throat> I need a drink, sorry. I actually need something a little more than coffee. <laughs> I'm just too excited. I'm wired. Um, yes, my friends, I am so sorry. I hope that your country will be safe again very soon and that the stupid COVID will go away and that you guys can enjoy a family Christmas with your family. That's, that's what I hope for you guys right now. I hope that this next month where you guys are really shut down, I hope that the numbers recede. And of course, I'm always thinking about my American neighbors too. It's absolutely wild to me to look at the COVID numbers right now. It is, it's worse than I ever honestly thought it could be. So I'm just, we, we need Jesus all up in this, okay? We need, <laughs> we need the birthday boy to fix this situation as quickly as possible and everything going on with the election and stuff too. It's just, oh, I'm happy that I'm a Canadian, but also we got issues too, honey. <laughs> Best believe we got our own issues. But anyways, I am so grateful to be able to share this Christmas with you guys. That is my like, oh, my heart is just like, like, overwhelmed. I'm overwhelmed with the amount of love that I am getting and I'm so thrilled to be able to spread joy and love to you as well. Um, I do want to mention quickly, um, I'm going to be doing a giveaway very soon. Um, Curtis is trying to help me come up with ideas of things that I want to give away. So keep your eyes locked on the channel. Make sure you subscribe because you're not going to want to miss the chance at winning some stuff from moi. Um, <laughs> I think I'm actually going to give away more than one thing. Like, so there will be multiple winners. Um, but I, I want to do that before Christmas so that you guys can receive it as a little Christmas gift. So, and don't forget, send me a Christmas card in the mail. My description or my, uh, what's it called? Mailbox number, my address. Thank you. PO box is in the description. I said, thank you to myself. Okay. Um, send me a Christmas card. I'd love to send you one back. Um, and I'm putting a little treat inside each card as well. So that's kind of fun. And thank you guys for being here. You guys, like I have waited all my life for Christmas. <gasps> okay. I'm sorry. Somebody told me I need to stop shouting in the videos. So sorry. I'm excited. What do you want me to do? <laughs> Anyways, I love you so much 
And I hope that your day today is going to be the best day ever. Love you guys. Bye.